Hey everybody, the Ryman here, coming to you with another Persona 3 FES video. We are going to head out and build up our... Pff, our charm, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I sound excited for that. I wanted to go to Tartarus and kick some ass. But you know, I can deal. I need to adjust my headphones. Kinda just threw them on my head, said... Well, I'm ready. I kind of want to check out the Velvet Room first, just to see if there's any any new uh, requests. Oh wow! Bring me a Christmas star. Um, should be obtainable from someone on June 27th. I would like someone to use the wipe off spectacles. You should try to get it on the 20th. Bring me protein that's not meant for pros. I'm sure you'll be able to acquire it on the 16th. Yes, I'll take this request. Because it's really close. Oh my god. Alright, first off, how many have I taken so far? Only two. These two can wait. I would like to explore your world further. Please take me to Iwatodai after school. Bring me three Jack Frost dolls. I want one to display, one to trade, and one for myself. The Shell of a Man. I heard that there's a creepy looking model in your world that's used for scientific study. I'd like to see it. I heard there's a rare item in your world known as a Goggle-Eyed Idol. Retrieve the third old document. Three snake figure scales and three five bronze figurines. Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff to do. You know, we're gonna take this one. Take Elizabeth to Iwatodai Station. Get some protein that's not for pros. And retrieve one bronze medal for on the third block. Alright, sounds like a plan. I guess depending on what's going on Friday afternoon, I will either take Elizabeth out or I will focus on a social link that I feel needs to be focused on. A lot of quests, <laughs> a lot of requests opened up. I was pretty surprised actually. I just kind of went there at a whim. I'm gonna want to study. Keep building up those stats. I'll try to fulfill as many requests as I possibly can. If I'm right, on the 16th, I'll be able to ask one of my buddies in the dorm for that item. Probably gonna be Akihiko or something. Oh, hey, Ikari. Morning. Hey, Ryokun. What do you think about Fuka? Oh, shit. Um. I don't know what to pick. This might just make me sound like a tool. This might make me sound like a perv. What's worse, being considered a perv or a tool? not what I meant. Doesn't it seem like she was kind of forced into joining us? I hope she'll be okay. Why do I feel like we're going to turn on the people that we're working with eventually? Hey, did you hear? Ikoda's in hot water. Really? What'd he do? I don't know, but it must be serious. Sexual harassment, maybe. What the hell? Oh, I could totally see that. Hey, look. It's the ghost girl. Quiet. She could hear you. Um. Fuka, you in here? Moriyama-san? I heard you started living in the dorms. 
Yeah. Oh god, is she going to bully us? You seem so depressed. Let me know if you need someone to talk to. Oh. We could probably use a friend, huh? Moriyama-san. Oh, come on. Just call me Natsuki. Thank you. There we go. Natsuki turned over a new leaf. That is great. I'm actually pretty relieved of that. Oh, shoot. Of course there's something you need to tell me. Oh, boy. Yeah. Well... Elizabeth, you're gonna have to wait, because I have responsibi- Oh shit, antique shop. I have responsibility. oh shit. I forgot, I left a weapon there. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be using this, but it's probably gonna be beneficial for me in the long run. I wonder if the antique shop is open at night. Alright. I've never seen a weapon like this. Make good use of it. The Mother Saber. So I can trade my gems in for different items. Ooh! Yes, actually. I'll take two Fierce Sutras. What up? I need some turquoise, uh, gems. I'd like to fill my inventory up with some protection sutras because those really helped out. Oh, here we go. Goggled Eyed Idol. I need this to fulfill one of the requests, so I need two turquoise. And there's all these cards, which boosts up persona stats. And it says I can fuse weapons. I'm not going to fuse any of my personas with it right now. I only have five. Alright, let's equip the Mother Saber. It's definitely a boost up. Less of a hit percentage, but I can deal. Such an in-depth <clears throat> RPG. Alright, Kenji, my man, what are you going to tell us? I'm hoping this boosts up the relationship and it's not going to be like a three-second thing. You're saying your relation relationship could be stronger soon. Wink, wink, soon. As in not right now, so get the fuck out. I mean, get the bleep out. I'm trying to say that word less. Hmm. That was a generic response, so... Eh, let's meet with him. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get the three second thing. Port Island Station. Oh, here we go. I was kind of anticipating, since it wasn't like a different type of response, that it was going to be like, you go to the Wild Duck Burger, and then nothing, but here we go. <clears throat> hey man, I was going to tell you this when we got to the ramen shop, but now's as good a time as any. I've decided to go to Kyushu with... Um, oh, fuck. Damn it, I said it again. Sorry. I've decided to go to Kyushu with Amiri, so this will be my last bowl of ramen, dude. What the? Is that Amiri? Who's that she- Who's that she's with? Uh-oh. You can hear bits and pieces of Amiri's conversation. I didn't think you'd get so... 
He's just a kid. He must have misunderstood my... I thought he'd be relieved that I was being transferred. He said he wanted to... The other students are... It won't be much longer. I'll pick you up on our wedding night. Ah! Oh, I was partially right! It, w it wasn't her moving to protect him. It was her... I guess in a sense it kind of was so he could get on with his life, but... Holy shit! I can't wait either. I didn't even know she was leaving today. I thought we'd be together forever. Kenji seems like he's gonna cry. What will you do? Yes, I'm going to laugh at Kenji. No. Confront Amiri, that's not the right thing to do. Console Kenji. S stop it. Why are you trying to make me feel better? I'm an idiot. You should be laughing at me. Kenji started to cry. Ugh, I'm such an idiot. A stupid, stupid idiot. I should have known this would happen. Why, Amiri? Why? I can't shout. It's three in the morning. <laughs> Kenji is crying. Oh man. Oh, my nose is running. <laughs> hey, thanks, Rio. If you weren't here, I'd... Kenji is laughing as he cries. Your relationship is stronger now. Oh man. This took a dark, dark road. But I kind of expected it, too. We we all expected it. It's just kind of hard to... hard to listen to. It's sad. Let's go home. Alright, we're one level away from maxing it out. Sup, dude? They're getting Fuka's room ready on the fir third floor, but no guys allowed. It's cool, though. I'm just glad she's coming. She'll be here tomorrow, you know. But does this mean we're not going to Tartarus again? I heard Fuka's teacher, Mr. Mikikota, got in a lot of trouble. It must have been because of Misuru Senpai. Scary, huh? <laughs> Where the power of Kirijo? Or Kirijo? Mitsuru and Yukari are in the third floor getting Fuka's room ready for her. They're cleaning it up, you know, dusting and mopping. They said they'd call us if there were any cockroaches that needed to be killed. How nice of them. I think I'm getting a little antsy. I want to get, get onto Tartarus, man. But you know, at the same time, all this character development, I can't really complain, huh? Oh god, the moment I, like, sniffed with Kenji, my ear popped. Go figure. I apologize for not being able to go to Tartarus two days in a row, but preparing for Yamagishi's move has taken longer than I anticipated. So that's that. As you can see, the girls' rooms are on this floor. Males are not permitted. That room is filthy, even though that no one's living in there. Oh, please don't let there be any cockroaches. Alright, we're not going to get anything done here. Okay, I can spend 500 yen. 500 yen isn't bad. Continuing to build up my charm. For the inevitability that it will... Why am I even doing this? Even if I got my condition up to grade, I can't go to Tartarus anyway. Oh shit. Why am I always getting interrupted with bad stuff? You've prevailed yet again. But it's funny. It doesn't seem so certain considering the vast potential within you. As a matter of fact, your power seems to have changed quite a bit. 
What are you talking about? Hey, if you don't mind, can I be your friend? I'm very curious about you. Is that okay? <laughs> oh, but thou must situation. No. Fine with me. No, I want to know your name. Name? Oh, I see. I need a name. My name is Pharos. Pharos? You may call me that if you wish. Alright. You're joking. The death. The death arcana. Why am I not surprised? We formed a social link with the kid who's been stalking us this entire time in our head. Or is it just like in general? Because I don't know if he's in our head or not. It's getting late, so I'll go now. I'm already looking forward to our next meeting. Hmm. I don't know. Something feels very off. I mean, I'm glad we got a new social link. Still. Good morning, Zyken. Yamagishi will be living in the dorm with us, and starting tonight, she'll be providing us with support during battle. So now I can rejoin the front line. <laughs> but you're unreliable! No. Yes, you can depend on me. Even though I'm a bit out of practice, I will soon return to my prior form. Sweet. This is gonna be awesome. No Kenji. So maybe we'll take uh, Elizabeth out. I'm glad there won't be a full moon for a while, but still, I can't help thinking about it. Yeah, it is on my mind too. <sighs> adjust, adjust. If we're getting a new teammate, maybe there's some new stuff at the station. The police station, mind you. Nope. Alright, let's sell the saber then. Sorry, Nizo Nizoru? Or Nizobu? Shit, I forget how to pronounce your name. Or how to spell it, actually. Go on a date. Ah, I've been expecting you. Shall we be on our way? Let me guess, I can form a social link with Elizabeth. Are you serious? She's walking down the up escalator. Sweat drop. Three, two, one. Darn. Flowing stairs that must be mastered by those who would try to pass. So this is an escalator. It looks simple, but one false step and challengers will be mired in exhausting ordeal. Yes, I mean, I've had my struggles when I go to the mall. Whew, those escalators. Warning, please refrain from going up the down escalator and vice versa. Thank you. Oh, God. And what's this? Please watch your step. There's a pitfall just ahead. Where is it? Oh, wow. It's in the center of this fenced off area. You know, I'm kind of wondering about this too. What is this? It's marked with eye catching signs which state in bold print do not enter. Humans frequently crave that which is forbidden to them. 
This is a crafty snare that goes against the common notion that pitfalls must be hidden. A stairway that tests one's wits, and a pitfall that tests one's inner strength. Human authorities have a great deal to contend with in their quest to defend the town's law and order. Yeah, let's go with that. I'm very moved by their plight. Let's continue forth, our thoughts dedicated to the unsung heroes who love this town so very much. You know, this is a very strange date. I'm not complaining, by the way, because Elizabeth is kind of cute. Yes, this fragrant aroma, it can't be. Oh yes, please be, please be a lure to the wild duck burger. Damn it. Whoa! You can figure out our secret ingredient just by its smell? Oh, I guess you don't wear those funky clothes for nothing, lady. Well, there ain't a law against takoyaki shops cooking stuff besides octopus. Oh, dear God. She sounds like... Now, don't judge me. She sounds like the person who voices Bonnie from Lilo and Stitch. Yes, I've watched that cartoon. Yes, I did like that cartoon. It'll make you smile so wide your cheeks will fall off. Cuisine so luscious that one's cheeks fall off. Such a result would cause havoc in reality, but I definitely like to experience this. It was a figure of speech. Also, maybe it's not her voice because it's kind of low. Elizabeth produced a bulging wallet. Uh, it's not that expensive. You're buying that many. Yeah. I appreciate the concern, but my curiosity exceeds any monetary. Oh, I see. Upon closer inspection, one package is only 400 yen. Ooh, well then, two packages, please. I, th I think I just saved her from spending all of her money. Remember when she dumped Thanks. it all? Here you go, and come again! Dumped it all in right into the fountain. This distinct texture. Firm, chewy outer skin. There's no doubt about it. I must say, I'm surprised to come across this used as an ingredient in food. Hmm? The human mind. It is cursed to forever harbor whatever knowledge it gains, whether good or ill. Forgive my reticence, but there are things your kind is better off not knowing. Oh please, I eat processed food all the time. I know there's a lot of bad stuff in there, but I still eat it. Hmm. You finished eating takoyaki. There appear to be several dining establishments around. I wish to try all of them. My first priority is to visit something called a manga cafe and obtain a foodstuff known as a smoothie bar. This smoothie bar allows for an infinite combination of flavors by mixing various ingredients. I want to go to Jamba Juice now. Just thinking about it gives me a sort of electric tingle across my tongue. I decided to show Elizabeth around the eateries. We appear to have exhausted the culinary possibilities in this area. Ah, oh, so full. Have room for a muffin? No. Oh my. Are you feeling well? Five bucks to whoever can catch that reference. Now that I think about it, you haven't eaten much since our seventh meal. In any event, I have to thank you for the tasty experience. If you don't mind, I'd very much enjoy accompanying you again. Wow, why do you say that in such a seductive tone? I like it. You headed back to the Velvet Room. Well, that was a nice date. I'm gonna keel over any second now. I eat too much. 
Thank you for showing me around Iwatodai Station. The fascinating rides, the dangerous traps, and of course, the cornucopia of curious cuisine. The people's lives there were quite different from those at Palawina Mall the other day. So that I might not forget what we saw, I'd like to recreate some of the dishes we tasted. First, I must hunt for ingredients. Haha, <laughs> this will be so much fun. As for your reward, I've again prepared something special. With this, you can fuse Ampuza. It looks remind one of a beautiful beast, yet she too rises from the sea of your soul. I wish I could gain a greater appreciation for what your soul is like. Cool. Alright, let's accept a new request here. I could create Oberon eventually, but I'm not close to level 17 yet, I don't think. No, I'm level 16, I think. Um, either way... Let's take... Hmm. Let's take this one. Ah. Alright guys, so I am out of time for this episode. Spent most of our time going on a date with Elizabeth, and we still have any kind of social link we can find to exploit and enjoy. So if you guys have enjoyed this, I encourage you to leave a like and comment, as it helps and benefits the growth of the channel, as well as any future dates with Elizabeth. And of course, also tells me you guys are enjoying this. I am the Rye Man, signing out. Pop the call. Have a good day, everybody. Happy gaming. I'm such a dork.